Well, I, you know, I believe in miracles, and uh, no one's ever worked any harder at rehabbing than Jose Rio. He's had four surgeries on that elbow, and we pray for him every night, and uh, uh, when he gets on that mound, I think we'll all be happy. Could it be, after four years and four significant surgeries on his elbow, can Jose Rijo make it back to the big leagues? Well, he's trying once again as he did two years ago. But this time around, Rijo is taking a much different approach, more cautious approach. And as Andy Trinan reports in Reds Roundup, everybody's watching and waiting and crossing their fingers for the man called Rijo. For four years, from 1990 to 1993, he was named the Reds' most outstanding pitcher. He was named to the All-Star Game in 1994, but didn't pitch because of tendonitis in his right elbow. It was a sign of things to come. Don't move, don't talk out of time, don't think, don't worry, everything's just fine. A strike shortened that season, and four Tommy John elbow surgeries have shortened everyone since. But this spring, Jose Rijo is again attempting a comeback. I just, I just love pitching. I love the game, you know, and I miss it. Three years without pitching has just been driving me crazy. And when you're young and open, you got the ability and the power to do it. You know, why not keep trying to do it? Dr. James Andrews has performed all four surgeries on Rijo's elbow. He saw Rijo throw for the first time since his last surgery last Friday. He's cautiously optimistic. Well, it's about 150 pounds of force pulling on it every time he throws that baseball hard. Uh, so it's a, it's a vulnerable ligament, a normal ligament is vulnerable, as you well know. So we're talking about one that's been made and remade and patched and everything else. It's just a matter of uh, mechanically making sure he's sound, and then over time it's just a matter of if the elbow will be able to handle throwing a baseball at 90 miles an hour, and that's something you find out in time. The Reds aren't counting on Rijo in 98, perhaps because he's had four surgeries on his elbow and hasn't pitched in the big leagues in three and a half years. In fact, Jim Bowden says it would be a miracle if Jose ever pitched in the big leagues again. Jose says he expects it. You know, when they asked me that, I said, no, it's not a miracle because I always know and believe that I can do it. I'm expecting a miracle. There's something that's it was supposed to happen, and to me, it's supposed to happen. Rijo's comeback approach is different this season, and so is his medical prognosis because for the first time since Jose's first surgery, his elbow has completely healed. Before, it never healed. And I don't know, for some reason, I never have any blood supply going through my elbow, and now I do, and, and to heal. I think this last episode last year got his attention. Uh, he's, he's really uh, uh, matured a lot about uh, being realistic about his injury and his, his return. And uh, he's, uh, for the first time, he's cautious about what he's doing. He knows this is his last shot. A secondary definition of a miracle in the Oxford American Dictionary is a remarkable example or specimen. So whether Jose makes it back to the mound or not, after all the work he's done, he's already a miracle to some. There's probably only one guy in baseball that could come back from all this injury he's had, and he might be that guy. We can only hope. Andy Trinan, 1960.